Get on it. That's fine. That's yeah. fine. Holy shit. Yeah, what an idiot. Hey friends, Robert here with Coastal GX, out here at South Padre Island. Yeah, look, if it sounds kind of funny, that's because my microphone system has been crapping up. Been trying to experiment with the camera just to, just to even say a few words. Anyway, let me get right into it. We are out here for Tacoma World. Uh, I got here a little earlier this morning before the, the main group got out here. And uh, I'm supposed to be meeting a couple of friends uh, right now I'm on my own. I'm not gonna stay overnight. I just came out here just to relax Maybe check out some rides, you know have a good time. But anyway uh, Please bear with me with the audio situation. I might not be doing a lot of vlogging Maybe I'm just gonna be doing some narrating because yeah, this thing is not dependable and I, and I feel that audio is So important. I know you guys expect the best, you know, so hopefully we can get that squared away, you know down the road but anyway, uh, yeah, like I said, gonna be out here. And uh, there's a lot of awesome vehicles going up and down the beach, you know, so I can't wait to, uh, to get with them later on this afternoon um, when the temperatures kind of cool down. By the way, uh, I, I just decided to set up out here right at the edge of the water, okay? Right by the shoreline. And let me tell you, I, I've been talking about this in the last few episodes, but it is brutally, brutally hot. I mean, I've been, you know, drinking a lot of water, uh, Pedialyte, you know, trying to stay hydrated because you are going to sweat. I mean, the humidity level is crazy out here. Very little wind, very little sea breeze. And if you're going to get anything at all from the sea breeze, it's going to be right here, right by the edge of the water, as I've said before. So anyway, uh, yeah, let's see how the day turns out. I might do a little fishing. Maybe I will, maybe I won't. Let's see what happens. How you doing? You down here from Tacoma World? Robert Duncan came down from San Antonio to hang out with David from Overland Nomad and attend Tacoma World. David hadn't arrived yet, so he decided to hang out for a while for a good conversation, and he even got to do a little fishing. What's up? Hey, what's your name, buddy? My name is Stefan Araiza. It's Stefan Araiza. Where are you from? I'm from Edinburgh. From Edinburgh? All right. Driving this nice Tacoma? My 2009 uh, Tacoma off-road. Beautiful. Beautiful. Your first uh, Tacoma World? Yeah, my first Tacoma World. Nice, man. Nice. You watch the channel? Of course. All right. I've been watching the channel forever, yeah. Thank you. First time I get to meet you in person. All right, man. Well, you know, if you we're going to be out here, you know, so you want to drop by a little later. Yeah. What's up, Cheeto? What's going on, Robert? <laughs> How you doing, man? Man, that thing is looking good. Thanks, man. Thank you, man. You need to put that, that shovel back on my rack. Oh, it's a different one. It's a different one. <laughs> I, I have a small one for you if you want it. Uh, for the small vehicle. Oh, okay. Okay, yeah. <laughs> I, I, let's, let's, let's measure it up, okay? Yeah, we got a wheelbase. <laughs> How you doing? Did you get did you get to watch the video last yeah, time around? I saw your video. Still. What'd you think? It's good, good. Hey, good. You got some reaction, you know. I haven't read the comments or anything. 
One of my U.S. Fish and Wildlife friends dropped by to check up on us. If you ever get the chance, have a conversation with them. They are full of useful information and are always willing to educate you on the laws and regulations. Rabbits on that shit, yeah. Okay, guys, so we were waiting for uh, Dave from Overland Nomad, but I'm told that uh, he got caught up over with the big group. So what we're going to do is just pick up camp. Duncan took off uh, right before me, so I'm heading over there as well. I want to get some nice video of the Tacomas that came down. Uh, I got Nacho and my brand new friend from Edinburgh following him. Um, so we're heading back to where the group is. And uh, so, yeah, can't wait to see those trucks, man. Just from what I've seen so far, a lot of cool stuff over here. So, so happy. Uh, so many people from around the state that were able to make it down. So that will be interesting. Unfortunately, I don't think I'm gonna be able to interview anyone. Uh, the microphone situation is bad so hey technical problems these things happen first time it happens to me in a long time but uh i would rather you know just switch it up instead of bringing you crappy quality uh video and audio okay as i was getting closer to the tacoma world group a red dodge pickup in front of me came to an abrupt stop i thought the driver had picked this odd place to admire the scenery so i honked at him I quickly realized there was something wrong. Did you stop? Oh. All good? No, my phone will wait on me. But you need help? You just need help. Oh, I don't know. Yeah, I need to. His 4x4 quit. Oh, shit. Yeah. Brother, you want to put it on your. You know I always encourage people to help each other out, so I decided to help the gentleman out with assistance of Nacho, his brother Adrian, and Estefan. This was supposed to be a simple recovery with my kinetic rope, soft shackles, and proper recovery points on both vehicles. However, things got a little spicy thanks to what in my opinion was careless driving. On it. That's fine. That's yeah. fine. Holy shit, what an idiot. Dude, that was messed up. Take a look for yourself as how the white pickup truck came within inches of a man standing by the shore. He also came very close to me. Any off balance step from me or a skid from his truck could have caused some serious injuries and property damage. There was plenty of space towards the west of us, so there was no need for him coming so close to the people along the beach. You can see plenty of vehicles circumventing the area just fine. I'm sure his powerful Dodge truck could have easily driven on the softer sand. So this leads me to believe he was just an inconsiderate driver or probably too scared to drive on any loose sand. So Roger, can you... Yeah. Should I guide me back because I'm gonna, I'm gonna go back and then I'm gonna yank him out. Okay. Yeah, let me get out of the way. Okay, tell him at the second horn. <laughs> <laughs> gotta gotta buckle up bro I'm gonna get whiplash
straighten those tires up. Straighten the tires. Tell them to straighten up the tires. Turn them a little bit this way. There you go. We're good. Do you need a donation for your YouTube group? Huh? Do you need a donation for your YouTube group? No, channel? but I do have, uh, I do use, um, I do need favor. Okay. I have 6,300 followers. That's pretty good for a Valley YouTuber. I need to grow my channel. So please go there, leave a comment. I'm going to create a little something. Hit likes on all my stuff. Subscribe. That's all. That's all I asked for. <laughs> How do I find your channel? Coastal, Coastal, Coastal GX. GX. That's simple. Coastal GX. Yeah. Sir. Yeah, what's up, man? It's okay. Esteban. Hey, Esteban. Yeah, I had a silver Forerunner back there a while ago. I just wanted to say hi, man, oh, personally. Nice, yeah, man. Yeah, I know you get a lot of people, so it's finally nice to say what's up. You ever see me? I'm in the Lunar Rock. Because I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to park over here, here and get some video and everybody. Hi, uh, with with, hi there. Yeah. Hi. Okay, I'll let you yeah. do your thing. Is that, is that David? Are we over yeah, yeah, Brian. We're we'll probably go around Dude, the other side. Here. Nice to meet you. Can I get your autograph? Yeah. What's up, buddy? What's up, Hunter? Hey. I used a deflator today. Yeah. Cool, thanks. Go Dude, to let me let me get a go around that other side. They're probably better off going around through here. Oh yeah. Around. Or there might be oh no four here parked there, so I'll let you go all the way. And then yeah, then. I'll probably go around the other side. Uh 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 uh. <laughs> Slow down, Sorry, sir. Slow down. Slow down. Slow down. Took a few kids out there. I saw you. You're just black. Slow down. Save a clown. Oh, hey, this is you right here. Yeah, this is my cousin who's hiding behind you. Uh, I was like, is that his or what? Yeah. I wonder if there's an access to the back. Nah, just for a little while. Yeah, what the fuck? He doesn't Hey, what's up, John? Hang out with my cousin now? Huh? Hang out with my cousin. Which one's your cousin? He's dude. That's a tall man. Yeah. Let me, uh, well, let me see where I can park. I don't want to, like. Put it in front of me or. or what? Oh, through. I have to go back this way? So, wrapped up the day. I was able to talk to some of the folks out here at uh, Tacoma World, very friendly people, and uh, just lovers of all things Toyota. Specifically, uh, specifically, you know, the Toyota Tacomas, obviously, but we had Forerunners, you know, there's all sorts of cool vehicles out here, and, um, you know, I, I'm just happy that, you know, they kind of accepted me into their their awesome uh, little uh, world of uh, of Toyotas. I know I don't have, it's not officially a Toyota, but it is kind of a Toyota. So thank you so much for, 
for uh, uh, letting me in. And uh, so now we're gonna make our way out. Nacho's gonna follow me over here. A lot of the folks, they decided to stay here. And, uh, and as you can see, some of the folks are still here. You know, they're gonna be staying in here around this area right here. And, uh, but we are gonna call it a day. We're not gonna spend the night here. Um, we got other things to do. By the way, I, ha I have to put together all sorts of videos and, you know, so I'm gonna be working on that. Anyway, thank you so much, guys. I appreciate your support, you know, your continuous support. Uh, I really appreciate that from the bottom of my heart. Uh, I'm sorry that I couldn't meet with everyone. And, uh, but I, I, I do want to say, you know, thank you to the folks that did stop by and uh, were able to come and say hello and introduce themselves. And, you know, I got to see some faces that I've seen before. So all that is pretty neat, you know. But anyway, all right, folks. Love you. Take care of yourselves. God bless.